Is it time for the glorious return of James Marco, St. Marco? All right, he's going to be born in 2001. 48 years. James Marco's 48 years old and he lies about it. Now we get to have some fun. Yeah. Oh, yeah. James Marco. Insane cheekbones. The most insane cheekbones you've ever. Yes. The most insane cheekbones you've ever seen. <laughs> Dude, he's had some work done for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Mm, James, <laughs> mm, James Marco. Now we need the iconic James Marco bowl cut, or else everything else falls apart. Ooh, yeah. Is there even? Oh. I, where's the oh the, there it is Ooh, yeah. <laughs> oh yes oh James Marco okay makeup he always rocked a little something you know it was never too over the top but James Marco definitely had on a smoky eye yeah, he definitely rocked a smoky eye for sure. Okay. Clothing. Okay. Oh, Jay Marco. Jay Marco. Oh, hello. Eat me, Jay Marco. And I'm back in the city. Oh. We've gone through all of them. I think this is the winner. Wait, first we need the signature shoes. He always wears ski boots. <laughs> Wait, I saw some. <laughs> Balenciaga. Ever heard of it, idiot? Poor. There they are. Bang! James Marco signature. Those are the signature James Marco ski boots. I need something very high fashion. Oh. The wait, the skirt? <laughs> James Marco's style is insane. All right, accessories. Oh. Oh my god. James Marco ate and left nothing. It is time. So there's a five-year gap. Okay, I I have a good backstory. James Margo was hired to work on very famous fashion brand. I was hired to do some designs for um, Yeezy, but it turns out Kanye West is Nazi, and I already carry that stereotype because I'm very German, so I had to leave, come back to Los Santos. Los Santos is a big old plate. James Marco about to eat it all up. What the fuck is happening in this city? It looked like goddamn apocalypse. Oh, I think I know this person. Hello? Hello, sir? Hello? I think I remember you from many year ago. Oi, oh, hello, young man. I've seen, I've seen your films. Oh, I've seen so many films of yours. Oh, my goodness, I remember you. Only a man this stylish wear pants up around his nipples. Absolutely. It's so good. Hey, I'm a big fan. I remember you in Backdoor Boys 4. Oh, yes. Backdoor Boys 5. Those were two of the most successful of the 20 Backdoor Boy movies we did. Well, that's good. It was always a delight. I only watched them for the artistry, the cinema. Of course. Come with what was that last part? What? Um, perhaps you could help me. I'm back in the city because I was doing work for um, Yeezy, and he turned out to be a Nazi. And oh, the allegations against me were already... They weren't great, so I had to come back and start my life over, and I went to Burger Shot, but... 
that's gone. Oh, nowadays, right down the street is the Senior Buns Burger Joint. Wow, I'm Senior Bun. Senior floor manager there. If you head on in there and tell them old James Randall sent you, they might, they, 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 if you tell, if you, if you, okay. if, that, if you, if that, if you say that, I did that with my brain. Oh, oh my gosh! Such a nice thing, geezer. Oh of my job. gosh! Real nice guy, man. You have mind bullets? <laughs> okay, I'll I'll come with you. The real man runs toward the burning building. Oh my God! Officers, don't worry. We're here to help. I'm gonna Mr. Randall, Mr. Baby Mr. Randall. Oh s no, Mr. sir! Randall. Please! Mr. It's Randall. so dangerous. Get that baby out of that car! I don't see a baby, but help him! Sure. There's a baby in there. Oh my god! I need his immediate assistant. Oh god, he taken too soon! Oh, he was trying to be a hero! There was a baby in there! Oh god, oh my god! Mr. Randall, you gotta stay with me, okay? Come on now. Let's back up and get the EMS room, okay? Okay. We can only assume that the baby was cooked alive. Another day in Los Santos. Oh, God, no, I not. not I the desperately baby. hope that a baby did not get cooked alive. That would be very grim. Oh, okay, okay. Mr. Randall, you'll be okay, all right? You're going to be fine, buddy. The burning is only very superficial, over 90% of your body. <laughs> Jesus. I hear they're doing things in the Middle East with replacement skin at hospitals. They take the skin off a pig. Or a weird beast, or a lamb, and they graph it on your face. That's where I got my chin uh, cleft put in, actually, in Dubai. Oh, okay. Do you think it looks handsome? Chin like half no. pig? Well, it's the superhero chin. It's it's part pig. They used the cartilage from the hooves to create the That's little. Very, it's very chiseled. Oh, oh thank you. You're, you're, you're really gay. I think we maybe should pay attention to my friend who's still boiling alive before, you know, but you can you can give me a few more compliments if you want. He's not going to hear. His eardrums were burned out of his skull. Excuse me. Excuse me. Ma'am. Yes. This is my friend. May I ride with the hospital to you? If that's okay with the police. That is okay with us, yeah. Thank you. So what is your name before you leave? Oh, my name? My name is James Marco St. Marco. I'm having so much fun already. James Marco is such a fun character. He's just a great bystander. You'll be okay, sir. You're in the hospital. Well, you're not in the hospital. You're in a mobile hospital or a ambo. I'm medical and I'm going to help get you there, okay? You might not be able to feel your skin right now. That's yes. lidocaine all over you, okay? Yes, I know that feeling. There are a few nights that I was in West Hollywood that I could not feel my face. I imagine it's like being burnt alive like this. So, I think I speak for Mr. Randall when I say, I think he a vegan. So if we were to use any skin grafts, if we could use a polyester material or spandex. Oh, that's, a, that's something you have to discuss with the doctors. Okay, yeah. I appreciate you letting me know, but that is something sure. you have to discuss with the doctors. Okay. While he is in jelly state, I think maybe we can do baby Botox in his forehead and give him a little mommy makeover. Maybe tuck his scrotum, make it a little tighter. That's very vogue. Are you to the waiting room? Sir? Oh, yes. Okay. Sorry. Yes. Come here. You're fine. I appreciate you letting the doctor know, but now he needs space to go ahead and take it. Of course. Sorry, you have to hold on. I'm, I'm wearing ski boots. It's hard to move much quicker than this. So, Aphrodite, what's your saying? What's your sign? February 12th. I was born on Valentine's Day. Oh, my God. This makes you hypersexual. <laughs> I, I invented yeah. sex, sir. In the Adam and Eve, yeah. I'm the snake. I was the snake. Oh, my that. God. I was going through this weird, like, scale phase. I was the snake in that. So, oh, yeah, my I'm, God. I'm Do you, temptation. I am having deja vu right now. Can I tell you why? Why? In 1985... I was in a club with David Bowie, and I swear to you, mm -hmm. he said the exact same thing to me you're saying right now. Do you think you are reincarnated, hey, David yeah. Bowie? Hi, how are you? Mm, probably. The oh, my God. I a lot in the 80s. Oh, my God. Is that Club 42? Yes. 
How did you know? Oh, yeah. No, I remember. I'm starting to get freaked out. The go-go boot girl. Oh, my God. Oh, no need to you did. You drank. This, you literally no took off my shoe with huh? my go-go boot and drank from it. This is uncanny. I'm getting to goosebumps. Oh, Jay. Congratulations. They tried to give me buttocks. <laughs> they tried to give you a buttocks? Oh, my God. Like, like, they did give you some buttocks. buttocks. Like, I asked them to give you small scroller tuck. Because, you know, if you're under the knife, why not get beautiful a little bit, you know, Mr. Random? Well, if he's already circumcised, there's not much to work with. No, 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 no. Not the foreskin, the balls. <laughs> hey, hey, kid. Hey, kid. Hey, you say you know me. Yes. I believe you. Let's get you to the senior burger. I, I think you're bleeding from your legs a little bit. <laughs> oh, I'm sure I'll be fine. All right. I got more than I need. Okay. So what are you doing in this town, by the way, anyway? What have you been up to? Oh, I, uh, uh, being 82 years old, I just try to keep busy, young man. I, I'm the senior floor manager at the Senior Burger. Oh, I'm my the God. senior receptionist at the Oshawa Wow. The senior clerk at City Hall. Oh, my God. The senior owner of the imp. 82? I wouldn't say you're a day over 81. Oh, you flatter me. That'll get you far in life, don't you know? Actually, there's a saying we have in Dusseldorf. I love that one. No, that's that's a, the place where the saying is from. I haven't said the saying yet. This is a saying that says, Do not peel your bratwurst before you've had your potato mashes. The right... How translated. That's and a good one. It's, it's a saying where it's kind of like, don't count your chickens before the hatch, you know? Oh. We've got a saying back in New York. Boy, boy, oh boy, there smells like piss out here. Oh my God. When do you use that? When it just s smells like piss? Typically when you open the front door. I want to hear some crazy wordplay, man. Absolutely. More than anything I've ever wanted in my entire life. You know the food dish? Beef stroganoff? Oh, for sure. She beefing? My strogan? Oh. <laughs> oh my god! It's it's the, the mushroom cream pasta dish, but it's also a double entendre for hand jobs. It's, a mu it's the mushroom cream pasta dish, and it's when she's helping you make your mushroom a creamy pasta dish. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, that will never get you old. Five years. At least the weather, it's a beautiful night for weather, isn't it? You know, a New Yorker might even say, Oh, we wow, it smells like piss out here. Boy howdy! Boy howdy! Is what we'd say. Boy howdy! Hitchhike! 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 Oh, shit! Oh, God! Where are we going? Uh, James! Hello? No. Taxi! No taxi. No, no. Taxi! No. <laughs> taxi! Taxi! Sir! Taxi! Taxi! What, is this typical of the taxis here? Sir, taxi! Taxi! Oh, shit! Oh, my God! James, are you okay? That taxi just hit you! He's one of my employees at the senior... They're fired! I'm sorry. Confused. I'm sorry. That taxi just hit you and drove off. I'm discriminating because I smell like lavender. It's a good idea. You should, you should try. Taxi! Wow, is that a real New Yorker taxi call? Yeah, man, it works over there. James, I, I hope I didn't take taxi. you away from... Oh, taxi! Taxi! taxi. <laughs> oh, no, don't worry, young man, don't worry. I, 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 I've got, I was heading to work anyway. Oh, where are you going to work? At the Senior Burger. Oh, yeah, we can work there together. I think I've learned how to hail taxi from you. I'll try... Taxi! Taxi! 
Oh, shit. Hey, hello. Oh, hello, taxi. Texas oh, here. hello, gentlemen. Hello, ma'am. Can you take us of to the, the senior burger? My friend here is I, I work. The, I'm the senior. Thank you so much. Yes. I'm oh, hello. Your floor man. Oh, hello. Your floor man. Hi. Wow. A real Los Santos taxi cab. Is your friend in the back seat okay? Huh. I, I don't know. He's, 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 I don't know. He, he got in the car with you. Oh. I, Wait, no. I, I'm, I'm talking about this man in the back seat with me. Is he okay? Oh, is there someone? Okay, so fun fact. I had somebody in here. I thought he ran away, but I guess he didn't. So he's still, he must be hiding. Uh, I don't, he's, oh, you're Google crazy, ain't you? Kind of unconscious. I think I'm going to die. All right. I think there was a dead man in the backseat weekend at Bernie style. I think we're ready. Excuse me, Officer Clitoris. Hello, Officer Clitoris. My friend said that I oh. should meet you. Oh, howdy. Hey, what what can I do for you? I just saying hello. I'm new to the city, making friends. Okay. Yeah. Look, I'm not here to make friends, son. I'm here. I'm here at work. Oh. Hey, it's, not, yeah, hey, it's no. nice to meet you, sir. Nice to meet you. James Marco St. Marco. Uh -huh. Nice to meet you, James better, Marco St. Marco. I'm, I'm Leon Cassidy, you, sir. Leon Cassidy. That's a good yes, name. Sir. Thank you. Leon, you have yeah. nice cheekbones. Do you have a model? I, I haven't ever, actually. Ooh. Well, if our paths cross again, I'd love to talk to you about maybe walking the runway. Okay, okay. Now I have to go work in a fast food burger establishment because I've fallen on the hard times. Oh, and who are you? Uh, Siobhan Fitzpatrick. I think I might be the only attorney in the city at the moment. Siobhan Fitzpatrick? I was actually for quite a long time the mayor I'm of sorry, Dusseldorf's what? Fist Boy. Do you know what that is? I know what Dusseldorf is, but I don't know what a Fist Boy is. Uh, it's probably for the best. Anyway, I don't want to take up much more of your time. Fist Boy? Yes. Fuck is a fist. Why did you ask? If you have to ask, you probably to, can't afford it. I know. I need to know what a fist <laughs> boy is. I need to know. Uh, well, James Marco, he's Saint Marco, right. please tell me what a fist boy is. <laughs> you see, sometimes there are men who require more than a normal amount of pleasure. One or two fingers won't be enough for their prostate. So, a man like myself with supple. Delicious hands you have pleasures them hands. in a extreme and violent way. You have really nice Vi hands. Violent. Thank you. So do they do, do they do a lot of this uh, fist boy work over there in uh, in Germany? Where are you from? Oh, let me think. I would say a fist boy is about as common as like um, an Uber driver here in the United States. <laughs> oh, okay. Well. Anyway, I know that. Oh my God, my friend got stabbed while I was talking to you. Oh Jesus! Who got stabbed? God. James! No, he. I don't think he got stabbed. James! What did they do to you? What happened to you? I was talking to the police. And you got out of the hospital, and I don't think they tagged up my bleeding problem. Oh my God, you bled out. That sounds like a lawsuit. He looks pretty shitty. No, it's just the, uh, the gelatin and everything kicking in, making it a little bit limp. Can I, can I get a little bit of that for my private uses? You can probably buy some from over the counter at the hospital. Oh. Stuff we have those for medical Okay, yeah. Workers. Do they have what are called poppers at the hospital too? Mm, they might do. You usually use That's it to, like, point. clean jewelry? And then you smell it and it loosens up your arse lick. <laughs> James, you cheeky old bastard, stop looking up my kilt. I think in broken spines it is. Oh no! James, don't worry, if we go back to the hospital this time, we'll get you that Botox for sure. We'll get you the Botox, quick neck tuck, eyelid enhancement, penal lengthening surgery, big toe shrinking procedure. Is that a thing? Oh, yeah. In Germany, a large big toe is looked at like you're a cave person. Really? Yeah, I had a, almost half an inch removed from my big toe last year. Okay. I'm getting in there deep. All right. 
There was one time I did too many drugs at a rave in Berlin, and they kickstarted my heart with taser to my grundle. Maybe try that. Quick grundle taser. I don't think we're gonna do it. He's got many artificial parts. Titanium hip. Lead pipe for femur. Here, hey. He got his shoulder replaced with a Keurig. Why don't you give it a, he's treated, man. Just help. I'm telling you, he's got. Oh my God! CPR under Schmeckle? That seems a draconian, even for me. Oh, he got oh, it! Oh, You're oh, a man. hero, Sheriff Cornwood. Yep. I, All better now. I was feeling good there. Ball, as to say that I feel fine, but I feel bad. Mm. Are you gonna shoot me with that gun? Because I will defend myself. No, not that. Hey, put it away. Oh, 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 James, why? Oh my god. Oh my god, he's got a knife. Wait, are you just gonna let him go into senior bonds with a knife port? That seems kind of dangerous. He put it away. He put it away. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what that was all about. But hey, y'all, y'all stay safe now. All right, I'm gonna. We're, we're gonna go ahead and get back out on patrol. All right, sir. Good to meet you, boss. Do I go over here? Sir. Yeah, talk to Steve here. He'll get you all on board. No problem. Sure. No tomatoes. Oh. This young lady is very experienced. She can help okay, you Okay, it's order well. 202. Hello. Wait, 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 you can pay right wait, at the register with I your card. I training people. Oh, don't okay, worry. Well. He's so smart. It's it's a little little very smart. Okay, okay, was, come over your here. order well, is well, number 202. You need to get in uniform. Oh, okay. All right. Do you have anything, Red, Couture? Your yeah. Order. No. The red polo shirt uh, with the right. yellow eyes. There you go. Mm -hmm. James, I, I have a question for you. What if I do something okay. like funky, fun, tutu, no. yellow, with like a scarf that's red, and maybe like wear a the, no, wear the polo red shirt. butt plug? Wear the polo shirt. Whatever else you wear is fine, just as long as you're wearing the polo. We're all. Mm, okay, where do I do this? Clothing still. Okay. Clothing, mm, litigation matters, etc. Where's the? Is this the clothing store? James, what's your seat ID? What? You're not going to believe me. Four. Hey James, I'm gonna go get my outfit and come back, okay? Now, but are you sure, James? That's really your seat ID. All right, I am gonna come back with the most ridiculous burger shot outfit you've ever seen. Here we go. Got it. Boom. Okay. Jackets. There we go. All right, we need now we can freak it a little bit. The bulletproof vest. I kind of like that. Is there a gloved option? Oh. What are the best gloves for him? Fingerless gloves. All right, maybe we can get him the old school, like, dictator <laughs> helmet he used to wear. Dude. Dude. I work in a prison of burgers. All right, let's see if I can't get him a hair that works. <laughs> Oh, there it is. James Mako. Okay. Scarfs and necklaces. Yes, this is what we were looking for. Oh my God. I don't even care that it clips a little bit in back. Actually, can I get like the dirtiest short shorts? Like practically a thong. Oh. <laughs> Okay, these are a very strong option. It's pretty good without the vest. All right, I like it. Do we like it? Okay, I I love it. I fucking love it. I fucking love it. All right, where is the burger place? Is this it? Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me, I'm just coming through. Excuse me, on your left. Get out of my way, bitch! 
Excuse me, on your left. Excuse me. I said, excuse me. Sorry about that. What are you looking at? <laughs> excuse me. Bring it. Hello, everybody. No need to stare. James Marco here to work. I'm gonna stand by the door and dance. I'm gonna stand by the door and dance. That's gonna be my job. Hello, welcome to Senor Buns. Oh, thank you. Yeah. I'm just putting the vibe out. Hey there, how was your experience at the burger shot? Oh, wait, Senor Buns, I'm sorry. It's been a long time. No oh worries. No Dang, worries. In your buns. What are you doing? I'm sweet. sorry. That should be a strike. Would you like someone to whisper softly in your ear as you order? God, that would be amazing. Ooh. While you're doing that, can you grab on my buns? Oh yeah. You guys hear that? I'm getting a warm. You welcome. said the senior donut is three ninety nine. The senior soft drink is two ninety nine. Mm, yes. They say that our burgers are 110% better than those other burgers. I believe it. <laughs> I can feel it. Would you like a frozen drink with your meal today? It's only 30 cents extra. Stop it. I can't do this any further. Oh, uh, sorry. I'm going to make sweet love to those buns if you keep this up. Oh, I'm, you sir, energy. please. Around me. I can't uh, believe this advance. I like this. I need that much. So, gentlemen, let's say that I had no fucking idea what I was doing and I've never made a burger before in my life. Y yeah. You should jump on the fire, my friends. They do great. The fire? Right there, right yeah, in front of you. you oh. Buns. Okay. Oh. All right. You have to just make sure you don't burn already. them, right? Oh, how do I know when they are not being burnt? Oh, they're toasted, oh, you know right? Burgers, See, they still seem a bit pale. You know what's interesting? Yeah. I worked at a burger shop for, I don't know, five years, and I never actually made a burger. James, I think this is the time where you would take them off, right there. Okay. Oh, the James, James, they're burning. So, is that James the way they're supposed to look? Yeah, no, that's a bit too late. Oh, I think that's a, a little, little too hot, sooner. you know? So they're almost done now. Oh, not quite. The ones in the back. When they stop burning, is that when they're ready? No, no. Just... That's not quite it. Doing great. Right. They doing great. Toasting. Oh, <laughs> they, so they're toasting now. <laughs> Don't panic. Whatever you do, do not panic right now. Oh, I'm not panicking at all. <laughs> interestingly enough, Lottie, it's okay. It's okay, Lottie. Just calm down. Third time's charm. Look with your third eye. Oh, third eye. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Oh, she no. did it. That's it. James That's is doing. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Make it. Doing great, James. I'll, I'll overview here. Okay, so now I just watch these. Yes, Look at for when they're done. When they're beautiful and golden. Do you know beautiful golden buns? Beautiful golden engulfed in flame. Without the flame. All right. Too hot. You are. I did it! Natural. Wow, I toasted buns. I'm a bun toasting machine. All right, I got this. Buns before. You did really good. Yeah. Now, now, do I stick my hand in this hot grease no. yet? No. Ah! No. Oh! Oh! Come here to the seat, That scalding hot right grease there. was scalding hot! James, <laughs> run, run some water underneath right now. James. Oh, yeah, you okay. Wanna, Let me come over here. Blister. Come on. Oh, no, that's a hot water sink. That's a hot water sink. Oh! <laughs> oh, this water is scalding hot! <laughs> hey, look at that. I finished the patties. Watching the buns uh, catch on fire was... Are we letting it marinate? Oh, oh, that one was extra well done. Toast in the buns. Before it's catch on fire. Don't rush me! <laughs> it's catch on fire! Uh, I think I... <laughs> yeah, rush on. This is your fault, you rush me! You made me panic! Okay, uh, okay we're doing this, we're okay. Really oh, <laughs> oh my god, I, I'm so <laughs> I put my hand on the grill. I'm so sorry. Oh, that's, you know, that's okay. You know, 
Oh shit! I burned my buns. Right. Is the I can't what see the them. On? They're being overseen. It's, it's it's not a problem. It's not a problem. Yeah. I'm sorry. I was cutting onions here. Burgers on the bun. <laughs> oh. no, I sometimes for some reason I cannot see the buns. Do you want to try another station? Would that be easier for you? If you can't yes, I'll go back to washing dishes. I'm sorry. Fry is very easy. I cry. Uh, I, I cry. You can no burn here. You're not gonna hold off and anymore. punched just, that poor you know, fucking in the grease. I just, just make sure you cut the hold off and, and sucked the fries in. And I just scoop some here, huh? Yes, yeah, just scoop it up, but just make sure you're not. Uh, make sure you're fulfilling an order. Dude, I swear to you, I was laughing so fucking hard when the bun started burning. And then I just hauled off and punched that kid in the face, dude. He goes, sorry, James Marco. I'm hearing a lot of talk of spunking. Does anybody in here spunk? Okay, so... All right, I'll go take a nap. Dr. Kelp, yeah, that'll do. Yep. Yeah, at the back there's Maybe James a nice Marco can just work at a different station for now. Alright, I'm going for a snow smoke break. Don't wait up for me. <laughs>